Hey guys, this is um, Powerline Kid back with another video. It's daylight savings time, so it's actually no, it's not. It's it's seven o'clock right now, and it's still pretty light out. The sun's setting now. This is my line that I've built over the years, and I put in a cross arm yesterday. I've used just dinky little four by fours, and then here's my dead end, dead end pole. Just check out some of the hardware on it. You got your dead end insulator and shoe. The jumper's out, and then I put a clamp right there. Then it's in kind of interesting because this is ACSR, and then this right here is guy wire. Focus. And then here's a clamp with a polymer shoe, and here's a guy wire that's. Well, Oh, I guess it did work when I tensioned it up. So it's working. Here's a grip. And then splice right there. These are called automatics, automatic splices. I also put this in last weekend. Also that one last weekend. And that one like three days ago. And right now, I've got a chain hoist and a ratchet strap connected to a chicken catcher and a chain hoist and a Klein grip and then a spool insulator with a and with a preform tie and then this is braced up and I'm gonna hang a cutout right there because it's got a cutout bracket. It's neat because it's got a hole manufactured to it so I can you can attach them on a cross arms with holes drilled. Insulators and crap, messy yard. Hand lines, flags, cutouts, fuses, wrenches, more fuses. Here's a fuse. I think, yeah, 10,000 amps, no, 100 amps, what is that, there's a cool, I don't know if you can see it, but, right, right here, yeah, oh, that's too close, right there, and, Here's some really old suspensions that I have. Suspension insulators. Old Ohio brass ones. And then a puppy cross arm fiberglass one. There's the brace for it right there. Here's a cutout that I'm currently taking off. Here's the guy water. That, that's also ACSR cable. And this is tamped down super hard. Is scrap stuff, crap that I. This is my tamping. Put the tamping stuff down. Here's another polymer with the brand new dead end shoe. Here's an old cutout insulator. And then here's one of my biggest polymer ones I have on a ratchet strap connected to my fence, which isn't a very good idea, which is a MPS um, 30 KB dead end insulator. Has all the original parts to it. I keep all the original parts to everything as much as I can. But yeah, this is Powerline Kid signing out with another video that I'm newly uploading. Please again, go subscribe to my channel if you really can, it'd be helpful. It's not, my channel's not very big right now, but I hope it gets bigger at the moment. Okay, bye guys.